okay, I'm philosophical. This is my channel. Let's just get down, right? So first off, I, I want to say again, there are a, there's a pile of rotting bodies upstairs in room 308 at the extended stay in Ben Salem, PA. Okay. <clears throat> Did somebody mess with that person in the rear, Monica? It's a man. All right. So the, when the first thing that was on my Urban Dictionary page, which is usually always a message, was protein spill. A bodily fluid that requires cleanup, such as vomit, urine, blood, feces. There's protein coming out of bodies upstairs. I don't know if, if I don't feel like this is healthy to breathe in. There are bodies rotting and stuff. I don't know if they covered them up with other, you know, or something, or saying that people are sleeping, but there are a bunch of dead bodies. Okay, it's around here, just here. All right. Um, so, yeah, that's gross. But then TPM is the people's man. Okay, this is a good guy. This is a great guy. Herself. So whatever that was, herself. Um, did it herself or... Okay, tell me about this, the people's man, right? This could be like a Tyrone, Peters... Pete Mopa, Tyrone Mopa, hold on, respond, respond, say something. Did somebody ask? Death. Could be a Scorpio. They could want to, um, okay. You know what this feels like right off the rip? They want to cut out these types of dudes. Okay, right? Yeah. These are like business owners or, or men that have a certain blood type, leaving a legacy that come from a certain bloodline. They want to cause division and they want to kill, kill, kill. Okay. Um, it could be any, any, it could be something like that. All right. But, um, the people's man, anybody who poses a threat to the, this agenda of the system, which is we want mean and evil because they the ultimate goal when I said this before was to get rid of all women okay how do you do that you turn men into real toxic motherfuckers and then they kill them this is what's been happening for a little while I mean probably more all right someone's been handling this herself right with no fear because there's no fear um, if, if there's a BOM right you just let that shit play out carry on proceed um, it's just to induce fear and when you take that away, you'll see a whole you'll see something different happen All right, tell me about this death now of the people's men Okay Hold on. This is like quick Yeah, so it feels like Somebody may be trying to figure out a way to run Somebody is an extension of someone else as well herself. She's an extension She's an extension of, of that person. All right, no fear. All right, um, or you're an extension of someone, no fear. All right, so somebody may be, or there may be some people who, who are trying to figure out like if a message was legit, right? They, these could have even been people, if there was a message put out about death being some kind of karma, they could have been like, eh, you know what I mean? But there's somebody who's trying to figure out if somebody's married as well. Like, is this person married? They, somebody could have even said that they're married to somebody and they're not married to that person, but they don't want, yeah, fool. This would be a Hayoka as well, but you could be an Aries or a Scorpio, right? And you could have came towards somebody to try to figure out if that person is available. And there could be somebody that actually said that they're married to somebody and they're not. This person could look like an absolute fool at this point, or they're about to look like a fool. Who, who's the person that said that they were married to somebody or that somebody is married? All right. Um, FR, this could be Frank, Fred, Francesca, Fran. Dylan, this could be a Francesca. Dylan could have said that somebody's married or something like that. Pay attention to what one person looks like and then the other person looks like. This could be Frank, Dylan, Fred, Dylan, Buck, Dylan, Buck. You know what I mean? That's what it feels like. It could be Frank, Fred, Dylan, Buck. This could be a Francesca and Dylan, Buck. This could just be a jealous couple. FYU, fuck you. You know what I mean? That's what I feel like. It's like, fuck you. Uh, we're going to say that this person is married or, or something like that so that, you know, 
you turn away or so that they leave. There could be a Scorpio that was going to leave because they were told that somebody's in a relationship or, or that they're married and, and they're not. All right, so now what? Yeah, look, in a relationship, okay? They're jealous. This is trying to stop something. Yeah, look at this shit. Like, like this is a friend, though. That's what this is. This this is a partnership, and this is my friend card. That's somebody's friend, right? So they could have lied, you know, obviously, because you know why, right? Jealousy. Jealousy. Right? They want to have control. They want to try and control the narrative on a situation, right? Let's see. Because... Why is this King of Swords here? Yeah, this could be an investigator or a detective or something like that as well. Or this person could even just work for the government or something like that, right? Tear, somebody could be crying now. Because they know that this person, like, damn, man, this is everything I wanted in a motherfucker, okay? Uh, yeah, and, and somebody... They wanted to leave somebody alone. That's what they wanted. They, they want somebody to remain single. And, and there could be at least one chick or something. This could even be Dina or Diana or something like that. Or Bunny. I mean, depending on who this is for. They are alone. This feels like scorn, bitter broads. And there could be some dudes too. Because there's a lot of dudes that just act like straight bitches when it comes to this shit as well. They could even have some kind of like... I don't know... What they would deem is proof that, oh yeah, I'm married to this, or they're married, or there's even messy, I don't know, it's just hair. Look at someone's hair. Look at the the hair color. Nick? This could be, this could be somebody that, I don't know if Nick is the one, this person can't hold a candle. Hold on a second, let me pause this for one second. I, I gotta, I gotta say something. Right. So they, they want somebody to be single and alone because this person is single and alone. All right, so, I mean, you know... It's really sad when you're not that kind of person who could do that to somebody. So you never believe it could be done to you. You know what I mean? It's it's real disappointing to sit there and wonder, how many times did my own friends and family ruin stuff for me? Whether it was a job or somebody that wanted to date you or, you know, these are people with the temperature. Jump, be careful. Somebody may want to jump you or try to jump you another person with the temperature there could be people who are turning like the temperature up or something to try to get somebody to come out to jump them like it feels real like straight jacket please <laughs> straight jacket please hold on a second let me pause this okay so now let's get one of these and see what's going on here control so, got the car looking more like freddie jackson somebody is a dude with a wig be careful look for a digging balls look for a taint look for an adam's apple man you guys are this is ridiculous are, are any of you guys asking questions when you partner up with somebody or is it just where can i put my dick where can i put it give me a hole any hole will do some of you guys are like this man where it's like you just need a fucking hole to put your dick in and it's getting ridiculous man they're men Gambling, alcohol, right? Addictions. That's what it feels like. Like, what, what, where can I find another addiction? I have a gambling one, a sex one, a gossiping one, an alcohol one, a drug one. I'm on social media, on my phone. That's it. You know what I mean? It just feels like the addiction, the level of addiction on people is unbelievable because people don't know how to isolate and stay to themselves. There aren't many people who can just be by themselves. How could you associate with people like this, someone's saying? How could you even associate with people like this? I don't know if it's Nick and someone is saying, how could you even associate with these types of people? Or or who is this for? Who, who, who are you saying? Like, how could you even associate with people like this? Buck? Our buddy? Keith? Kevin? Kelly? Travis? Trina, Tracy. Like, how could you even, you know what I mean? B, B, K, R. <clears throat> Beauty, knowledge, and respect. Are these chicks, are, are these chicks that are actually dudes? How could you even associate? Like, I feel like you guys are really, the bar is set low. You feel me? 
low. You want bitch kick rocks. That's what you should be saying, but there could be somebody else here that would never mess with shit like this, right? And this could be the person that was asking questions about somebody. So this is what happens. Yeah, you know, that person's taken, but this one's not terrible. Look at this shit. It's ter Like, uh, this one's not, though. This is my friend, Roger, okay, Rhonda, uh, or this is my friend here that is sick with HIV, it feels like you guys need to do this. You're interested in somebody. Let's say they are taken. That don't mean you immediately just replace that person with just whatever's around. You know, have some self-respect. Somebody does, though. I, I hope. Um. So what is this? So, give me something for this. All right. It, feel, it feels like there's a lot of people just settling. For whatever because they're lonely or you know or there's you know whatever the reason is if you patience is crucial what what this is how it goes you attract what you are all right you attract what these people are hungry so there could be people who are trying to set up something it could be a death for food there are people who are setting up hits for food okay so be wary of these people that you are associating with i mean look at them so there's a lot of people who are lonely. You know, I think that that illness played a part. People being separated and isolated and quarantined. But maybe you're supposed to be by yourself to work on yourself. Are you being, are you the type of person that would attract a good person? Have you become that person yet, right? Or are you still a cheater and a player and you want somebody that's loyal? You're not going to, you're not going to just, that's not going to be something that comes to you naturally. There's always some kind of manipulation involved, like a lie or a lie about what you have. And it's because you're not there. You don't deserve that type of person yet. Right. I had to figure this out. I mean, I always was a good person and I always picked up the broken motherfuckers, man. I was always the chick that wound up getting the dudes 12, 12 on the timer, um, that just lost everything, you know, and I would still be with them and be loyal to them. Cause it's like, I like to fix people. I had to stop fixing people and let them fix themselves. But there, for some of you, you may be this type of person where, why do I always get you after you just supposedly lost everything? Like, oh yeah, my ex took the house and a half a million dollar of this. Why, why can't you pay your cell phone bill then when you're with me? It's the same shit. It's because you're either too good for these types of people or you're the person that people need to stay away from depending on who this message is for. Couple trouble. You're like the personification of autumn, but with fewer dead leaves. I mean, so someone's name could be autumn. You know what I mean? Someone's name could be autumn that made this shit up. Terrible. This person could be terrible or this person could be sick with HIV. I bet that even your pancreas is beautiful. This reminds me of organ trafficking. It does. But somebody's so beautiful, like their organs are, are dipped in gold. That, so this could be the difference between two females. A preacher, somebody could be posing as a preacher. Tell me, tell me about this preacher. Huh? They're getting exposed. Opportunist as well. Um, let me get, let me start using these because I feel like we're going to get some secrets out with these right they said right all right talented dear so and so 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 they could have said that somebody else is um even a drug addict or a prostitute or something like that and somebody else is talented sold their soul trying to sell another person out man so be careful of hanging around people where you can look them in the face and go this motherfucker don't have a soul left anymore. You can tell by looking at people. Dear so-and-so, I'm officially embarrassed by you now. Couple of trouble. Is this someone you're in a relationship with or you are partnering up with that is even a dude? Fruits and veggies. You need to eat healthier foods. What you eat plays a big part in your mental. You are what you eat. You understand? So, I mean... I hope you ain't eating no ass and no dude, but I wouldn't be surprised if somebody went that far. A lot of you guys are depressed. They left? Who who left? Who left and now is dealing with a dude with a wig? 
Who who was this? Who 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 laughed about this? They could even be dead because the death card came out first. There could be people who laughed about something. Kinsley? Kinsley left? Is Kinsley dead? Kinsley. Kinsley left? Tell me the truth. Did Kinsley laugh about something? Yeah? Alright, tell me the truth. Is Kinsley still here? No? Okay. Everybody else want to laugh? And anybody else want to laugh at whatever people were laughing at? Because I feel like the universe is like, motherfucker, we'll show you who gets the last laugh in this shit, okay? Who, who, who wound up laughing? Sean or Selena? I respect that compassion, though. Where is it? Buck, Sean Buck, you left? Hmm? Sean and Lamont Buck, you guys left? I feel like you guys are the ones that stuck your... <laughs> in a hole, dude? Get your... Yeah, are you laughing now? They could be dead. I mean, I don't know. This could be the kind of thing where there was like... There, I mean, this is not eight or one. There could be eight people... Somebody else is supposed to be living in a palace, okay? They're supposed to be having a certain kind of lifestyle. And until that happens, until that happens, death is going to keep happening. Okay? Laugh. I want people to laugh at that shit. Because I feel like that's the best part for ancestors. Like, laugh, motherfucker. We want you to laugh when somebody says this shit. Because we're going to show you. We'll just show you. All right. It feels great. I mean, it feels great for somebody. It feels not so great for others. A little uncomfortable. That could be why they said that the protein spill. There could be people that a crime scene is what it feels like. Look, what a shame. Look at this shit, man. How many people have to have something happen to them because they just they feel entitled. That's what I feel entitled or I'm going to prove you wrong even if it kills me. Okay. Friend zone. So there could even be somebody that, that got friend zoned by somebody where it's like, yeah, I just, I'm not interested in you. And all of this shit happened because somebody wasn't, knows their worth or, or just didn't want a relationship or something like that, man. Tell me what this is with the friend zone. What a shame that this is all happening because somebody got turned down or an Aries. That this is somebody who wants, yeah, truth. There's an Aries somewhere that didn't like the fact, or a male, a toxic male. Yeah, so they wanted to, yeah, cold. Look at this shit. Why are you guys so cold, man? What happened to you guys? Were you guys touched as children? Did mommy or daddy, like, mess with you? Did your uncle mess with you? I mean, it feels like, what happened to people? I mean, shit. You want to surround yourself with people who have positive auras. Start to learn how to read people. It's because it'll it'll save your life in the times that we're in. You understand? This is sick. This is just sickness. Down with the sickness. Yeah, so there's some of us that aren't down with this. It's it's going to show a lot your worth, how how you view yourself by who you hang around. What is this? Stole us. I always think of stolen. But this, look at this owl. It's wise, you know? Wise and up, I feel like is what they're saying. Anytime that card comes out, it's always them going, wise and up. You know, that this isn't a time to just be having friends just because. We're not living in those times. Stole us. And people could have laughed about that as well. And then look, it's the same people. Ha 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 ha. They just don't have any friends. No, they're smart. They are what? wise okay you're not getting anything out of it i'm but they keep saying this if you're not getting anything out of a relationship or a friendship or a job leave leave them behind there could have been people who laughed at that shit and they wound up meeting their demise from the same people that they were told these people are going to wind up you know ha 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 focus on accurate appraisal and the search for true worth your one's worth is determined by the people they allow themselves to spend time with. These people are blocking great things from you. Who is this for? Who, who has a bunch of great shit happening to them, but when you're, they're around these people, they're blocking blessings, money, people. Zach.
a cop, uh, two cops could be. Is there either Tyler Zachary, Zach Tyson, Tyrone Zachary, put out fits? It could be Zach. Hold on. Keith or Kevin. You know, I, I feel like you know what, what is being said here. Don't just hang with people just because you need people around you. Rebel, rebel, rebel. You know, be, be rebellious when it comes to this shit. I feel like go against it. Don't just go with the flow and just hang with people just because. What's this? The Moose Crew. Well, I don't know what that is. All right. Had to call someone to bail me out of jail. Are you the person that always is there for people and they're never there for you? That's why they're saying yield. You're not getting anything out of these friendships, relations, nothing. You're always the one. If you're a cop, you could always let them go or help them out because you have access to shit. What do they do for you, man? Bride? A bride? Maybe you should be more focused on finding, like, if you want to get married... Focus on being the type of man that deserves, you know, that, that a woman deserves, a good woman deserves. Call the number graffitied in the bathroom stall. There's something about a phone number here being given out with the bathroom stall. Either it's a wrong number or there's, there's a number being abused. You know what I'm saying? Somebody ingested something again. I can feel it with my head. Worn a wonder bra. So look, somebody else is like fake. And you know what? A wonder bra, I guess. I mean, you know, I could see me maybe wearing one when I'm 80. All right? I don't need one now. And I'm 50. Gravity plays a part, a huge part in your girl's life here. Anthony? What's up with Anthony? There could be, this could even be, uh, Anthony, tell me about Anthony. This is a child. This is someone from your past, though. That you were loyal to, Earth sign. That, I don't know if you guys stopped seeing each other or whatever. What's up with this Anthony person? 50 and over? So someone's over 50. All right. Was it, they have an infant overseas is this person either Anthony's from overseas or there are people from overseas showing loyalty to some yeah interfere does, does this person Anthony have an infant this is child trafficking huh? yeah they have an infant with them who are you befriending it feels like, why are you choosing that side? Tell me, tell me, what's the infant? Michael or Michelle Gates or Paul? It could be more than one. Hold on. Tell me which one this is. Or this is like a Mifflin? Garrett or something? Garrett or Gar Mifflin? That's the infant? Did somebody's infant go missing and shit like that? Yeah, you're, you, I, you know, I, I guess I'm going to, okay, I'm going to explain how my discernment got so um, spot on. I had to stay to myself, right? Respect. You should be show. you're showing respect to the wrong people and not respecting those who deserve it. Why are you showing respect to somebody be careful of somebody just coming off and, and putting on their best outfit that day and, and spitting some words out and, and you believe in everything that you're seeing and believing, okay? Not even spending time with somebody first and getting to know them and then somebody just trying to put disrespect on somebody's name and, and th there's karma. There could be some people who even lost their lives because they chose to respect somebody who doesn't deserve respect and they disrespected somebody who deserves it. It's, it's death. I'm going to say it again. There's something that's happening on the planet 
where there's no second chances happening. There seems to be a lot of death. And I said this months ago, it was going to be suicides, uh, people putting shit in people's drinks, uh, whatever the fuck it is, just murder uh, because of the judicial system being so corrupt that people are just, you know, they know, they know there's no repercussion. So this is why isolation, you're only getting again, one version of a story. That's it. One fucking version. And until this happens, until people start questioning shit and saying, yeah, but I mean, and asking people and looking them in the eye and making them look at you when you ask questions, until that happens, the people who are making up the story and the people who are just believing it are going to wind up meeting their demise. Because you're both dangerous and toxic at that point because you believe everything without questioning. And this person likes to ruin people's lives, which means they will do it to you as well, right? Anybody who's only uh, just accepting one version will wind up losing their lives, okay? All right. It's just got to be like that. Forge your signature as well. I don't know if this is Anthony. But don't tell me somebody's got a life insurance policy as well. All right. We'll be on their knees begging for forgiveness. This is what I feel like. There are pe There are some people that have life insurance policies on other people. And instead of doing the dirty work themselves, they will create situations to get other people to want to kill the person for them. And it's like, well, thank you for doing that for me. Uh, and I'm going to go cash in on the life insurance and shit like that. Um, for any senators and shit that watch my channel, right? But life insurance needs to go away. It is a contract on people's head that serves no other purpose. Why not? Why, why? So now people can't wait till someone's dead, right? Someone's not going nowhere, though. Tell me about this forge. Forge your signature, okay? Or Anthony, they have a life insurance policy on you, all right? But this is very manipulative, man. Look at this shit. This is also a ritual that was done. People who did this blood ritual, this is a like a blood ritual and shit. Is going, there's nothing holding me back. Yeah, something coming full circle for this cult. They could have died. There's going to be some people that are going to see, damn, this shit is actually happening. Yeah, psh, right? Yeah, something coming full circle for a Scorpio, no doubt, though. Why? What did, what did this um, Scorpio, it was this, did this person part of a ritual? Yeah, I'm telling you, they put something in a bunch of people's drinks as well. It could have been this Kinsley. Kinsley put something in some drinks twice and is responsible for at least 10 people each time dying in a situation. Julia was part of that. The forum, they're saying, look at these people. Get a good look. Look at these people's faces. They're starting to look deformed. That means wasp meth. That means meth crack. Be, be, who's hanging out with these people? Sean or Selena? I asked who. Who put something in people's drinks? Seth, Sean, Selena. Hold on a second. Zachary, Sean Zachary, okay? Is this person looking deformed? It's because they're on all kinds of crazy drugs. This is like uh, making the drugs yourself is what it feels like. Like, oh, I got it. No problem. That's almost done. Ding! Right? Microwave, cooking shit in the microwave with wasp meth. They're going to try and take you. Anthony. Numb, emotionless. These are the people you're connecting yourself with, huh? It says that you don't feel like you deserve anything better than that. And that's a shame. Is currently what? Is currently, is something haunting you? Or is currently what? It is currently what? Yeah, no kumbaya with these motherfuckers, okay? Is currently trying to figure... Is, look, to end you. They're trying to figure out a way to fucking end you. They're trying to get you to come drink and hang out, okay? These karmic dudes, right? Yay, come on, yeah! Let's do this! So that they can, they can ruin you or... Are you getting signs? Aren't you getting signs? There is an Anthony somewhere. 
that is hanging out with people who are fucking deformed looking and are just like this reminds me of one of those horror movies where the family's just real weird you know like incest and you know those movies like what, what was that movie the children of the corn and shit that's what it reminds me of. Like, look at the, look, look, just look. <laughs> just look at these motherfuckers, bro. Who are you? Anthony who? Freeman? Is that what it is? Anthony Keith? Somebody meant green. Death. Look at. I'm going to end it at this. When you see people that look like they are uh, a few hours from dying because of the shit they're ingesting and the shit that they're doing, these people are going to wind up dying soon. Separate yourself. If you know you still have your soul, you know if you do separate yourself from people who are starting to look a certain way because this could even be black magic backfiring is affecting their looks in some strange way these people could be so infested with fucking entities and demons that it, their looks are starting they're starting to look like an entity like look at someone's face i remember uh this dude tom malone yo when i tell you they they mess with black magic and, and he came, I was in the house. I didn't realize I was lured there for a trap when they said I could move there. That's when this all started. He wound up dying in the room next to me, drank his own poison. Um, he came to the door that my, and I wouldn't, the crazy thing is this. He wouldn't cross the threshold. It was so weird. Like he had to be invited in. Because at one point, he uh, looked like he was looking like a demon. His ears got pointy. His facial features changed. I remember looking at him going, oh my God, like this dude just shapeshifted in front of me. And he look, he looks like a demon is trying, is manifesting from inside of him. Like real rap, the shit like I'm getting like, because I never seen anything like that in my life. And I said to him, he actually went to cross over the door. Do you remember I told you, Bri? Where I was like, he wouldn't come across the threshold. It was, they need to be invited into your life. That's when I, this is how deep this shit got. He went to come in and he goes, well, no, I don't want to. And, and it's like, he was waiting for me to go, no, you can come in. And I looked at him. I go, I go, don't come in here unless I invite you. And that made him more mad. Like the look on his face, there was some of these people, they're a demon walking. Okay. I'm, I'm going to, I want to ask on this shit is real. All right. I want you to tell me the truth. Are there some people that some people are hanging around where they are gone, completely gone, and it's a demon in these? Yes. Stay the fuck away from people who are getting involved with magic. This ain't the time. Drugs and trafficking. Okay? Okay, are, do they look the same? Are these friends of yours and shit, bro? Let me see. Let me get a demon card. Let me get another demon card. This reminds me of Fallen and shit again. Like the demon that's jumping in and out of people to get to somebody. All right, Bara Baptos. These people could have even been at the bar and shit like that. Or they just came from a fucking bar that's open 24-7. Um, but this is also natural. This is living a more natural life. Some of you guys are being forced with the fruits and veggies. These people are eating processed food that... That is a big deal. What you eat is a big deal for your mental. This is something that Brian and I found out. We are so we have such a peaceful life, and we have people constantly trying to disturb our peace, and it just becomes more peaceful because that shit's from in here. Okay, there ain't nobody that can rock your world when you're that strong. When you're strong spiritually, there ain't nobody that can rock your shit. Okay, don't rock the boat, rock the boat, baby. Yes, yeah, they, they're trying to rock the boat or tip the boat. Oh, no. <laughs> right? There could be something with a boat. Or somebody could have been thrown off a boat. That comes out a lot. Yeah, mental conflict. Look, cuckoo. Cuckoo. Right? Demons. I'm going to leave it at that. Don't say we didn't warn you. We're not going nowhere. Love you, Philly. Up.